Hi, good morning everybody. Welcome to another beautiful, fabulous Friday, December the 16th and one week away. One weekend away till Christmas. Next weekend is Christmas. So we're seven, let's see. Nine days till Christmas. Well, eight days. Because you don't take today and say 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Yeah, be nine days. Be nine days. But sorry for not having any videos yesterday. Like I said in my community post and on Facebook and everything. If you saw it due to a bad cough, there would be no videos. Because I could not. I wasn't. I wasn't. I had the energy. But the cough was so rough yesterday. Whoa. Did y'all see that? My recording just skipped. And then it's never done that before. But with that being and my the cough was so rough, I couldn't get it get it controlled and I didn't want to sit there and start talking all of a sudden oh, start hack hack and coughing. I'm still coughing, but it's not as constant. So if I get a, a if I get a coughing spell that comes up I will pause the video until it's over with, then I'll jump back into it once I'm once my once I'm stable enough. So there may be some jumps in the videos today and maybe tomorrow. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna see how, how much how far I can go on this. Today's videos, tomorrow's videos, and Sunday, so I can go ahead and get them ready to go. All I have to do is sit, sit down in the evening and load them up. And sorry for the videos the other day being late, but I sat down and started to edit one. I got, I just did get it done, and I was so dang up tired from driving on that on that road trip that I just finished it up, put it down, and then I forgot to get it done. So. Later that night, when I sat down, later the next night, when I sat down to do the next days, I went ahead and just edited the other two and posted it. As soon as I got them done, I posted it. So they went out way late, but yet they still came out. So they were already recorded, so why not just go ahead and just release them? So, but sorry. But today. The yesterday we were supposed to be talking about in our days of praise Old Testament prophecy but sorry I didn't get to it so it's not it's not that important of a video but today's video is today is number 61 of the it's all about God series and we're gonna be talking about God is faithful and this will be since we didn't have one yesterday, there'll still be uh, episode nine, um, nine thirty-two, part one. Should have been nine thirty-three, but it's nine thirty-two, part one. Our beginning passage is First Corinthians one, verse nine, and it's from Henry M. Moore. So, if you're excited about another Friday, the last, the, the weekend, but in. This weekend being the weekend before Christmas, smash that like button. Remember the four likes only until further know it, notice. And that's um, six, about 650, 650-ish and 200, 650-ish of the Daily Devos and 200 of the Turning Points. Being at four, at four likes, and then if it gets there, then I'll let it go. Then I'll open it up, and let it go. So I know it may sound weird, but that's just so uh, just an experiment I want to try. So, but subscribe if you're new. Turn on notifications. Share the video channel with your family, friend, 
Help me reach that 30 subscriber mark by January 1st, which is two weeks away. It's two weeks. It's two weeks from Sunday. So that's 14, 16 days. Well, yeah. Because you got nine days till Christmas. And add seven. Yeah. 16 days till the first of the new year before the old year says goodbye and the new year says hello <laughs> but if you do that right right now I'm at 25 so let's get those five in these next two weeks and I'll be happy and then we'll be going to 50 if I hit the 30 mark and then I want to be at a hundred subscribers for my birthday so please do that So please do that. So <clears throat> sorry. Sorry about that. So God is faithful. First Corinthians one verse nine. God is faithful by whom ye were called unto the fellowship of his son Jesus Christ our Lord. So when we place our trust in Jesus Christ as omnipotent creator and gracious redeemer. Then he faithfully undertakes to provide everything we need to live an effective, fruitful, victorious Christian life. For example, when we are tempted to sin or are tested in any other way, 1 Corinthians 10.13 God is faithful who will not suffer you to be tempted above, all, above that ye are able, but will with the temptation also make a way to escape that ye may be able to bear it. So in this connection he undertakes the ground to ground us firmly in his truth and to keep us from moral and spiritual harm. Second Thessalonians 3 3 says, The Lord is faithful, who shall establish you and keep you from evil. Okay? So when we do sin, however, he assures us that if we confess our sins, he is faithful and just to forgive us of our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. First John 1 9. That's a good memory verse. Remember that. With all our failings, he has undertaken to eventually perfect us in Christ, and he faithfully will continue this until it is done. 1 Thessalonians 5, 23 and 24. And that very God of peace sanctify you wholly. Faithful is he that calleth you, who, will, who also will do it. So all that he has promised he will do, even when we are unfaithful to him, he remains faithful to us. If we believe not, that is, are unfaithful, yet he abided faithful, he cannot deny himself. 2 Timothy 2, 13. So today's beginning passage that we started with assures us of God's faithfulness, following the promise that he will confirm you until the end, that ye may be blameless in the day of our Lord Jesus Christ. 1 Corinthians 1, 8, which is the previous verse. From our beginning passage. So therefore. We seek also to be faithful. And lastly Hebrews 10.23. Let us hold fast. To the profession of our faith. Without wavering. For he is faithful. That promised. Okay. So that's all I have for your God is faithful. The number 61. Of the it's all about God series. Coming up Tomorrow. We'll have a, a new entry into my little mini-series I called Ours, which will be number six. Which we left off number five at the beginning of the month. So, I did say that we were going to add a few more to it. So, number six for our 933 part one video tomorrow for your jubilant Saturday, December 17, 2022, we're going to be talking about our inheritance with 1 Peter 1 4, our beginning passage from John D. Morris. So stay tuned for that. I'll get to that in just a few minutes, but you'll see that tomorrow after 8. So, so I love you. I appreciate you. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Keep on keeping on. Trust in God. He'll keep you safe in all you say and do. In 2022 and beyond. But until later. Peace out everybody. 
So long farewell. Come back later after one. And we'll be talking about episode 932 part 2. Legacy of Faith. It should have been Friends for Life. But it's now Friends for... It is now Legacy of Faith. From Lisa M. Samra. Derived from 2 Timothy 1. 3 through 5. And you know why it's not that other one. So. But until then, God bless everyone, and I'll see you later. <laughs>